All right, to start off this face, I'm gonna be taking a little bit of a blue-gray color that I have. This is by Fab 2. And I cannot remember the name of it, but it's a blue-gray color. And I'm gonna sweep it on my face in certain areas, not all over. Now I'm going to go in with a little bit of a brownish purple. There you go. Nice brownish tone. A little bit of purple in there. Not too bad. You're going to do a portion of the nose where it kind of hollows out. You're going to kind of blend that down a little bit. You don't want it to be too prominent. Kind of blend that in a little bit. I need to be too prominent. Get the temples. If you mess it up a little bit, that's fine. You're a zombie. It doesn't have to be perfect. Going in with a sunken cheekbone effect. My light's dimming. What's wrong with my light? I need to change the batteries. Okay, I fixed my light and it's a little brighter now. Fresh batteries. So, I'm going to take a little bit of that uh, blue-gray. I'm going to go over spots and kind of blend them in a little bit better so that it makes it look a little bit better. I'm going to go in with a little bit of white using my Paradise and I'm going to smudge it in to this area and I'm going to kind of smudge it in to some other areas To take a little bit of yellow and a little bit of flesh tone. I'm going to go on top of that white a little bit and I'm just going to kind of yellow it out a little bit. Using the flesh tone color is great because it gives it more of an ivory appearance. I'm taking a little bit of a deeper brown color and kind of just putting it where I think shadows would be within the parts then taking a little bit of dark brown and kind of going in and deepening out those areas a little bit more. I'm going to go in with the black and I'm going to define the areas and stuff. So like right here and then I have a nice
going to blend in edges of colors a little bit, but I'm going to use my filbert brush for that. So I'm going to get that a little wet, and I'm going to kind of need to pick up a little bit of black, not a lot, just enough to blend in edges of things. So now that I have that, I'm going to go in with a little bit of black, a little bit more. I'm going to dry it out, pick it up, dry it out. I'm going to kind of model it in different areas. Just help it deaden out. And then you can go in and you can put in some different little things and you want to make sure you don't have too much white on but you can you know a little watered down you don't want it to be too prominent you can go in and add in some different little details make it look just a little bit creepier some oozing fluid from the eye But there you go. Nice little zombie for you. So what do you guys think? Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe so that you can keep up with all my videos this month. 12.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Every single day a new video will come out every day through the month of October. Last video is going to be October 31st and that one's going to be something special to watch. There might be something extra in it. I'm not sure. So keep watching the videos and I may drop some hints in each one as to what may go on. But that's up to you. Thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.